Hey, hey guys, Gray here, back with another episode of Caribbean. And I've been just having one of those days. <laughs> so, story time about today. So, um, yeah, it's been a long day. Uh, everybody right now has been sick at home, myself included, because I count as everybody. <laughs> um,. So, oh, and it's Saturday, just so you guys know. So, spent the entire uh, weekend home, sick, wife is sick, and with twins, and daughter is sick. So, try my best to look after them. <laughs> um, also, um, <laughs> I don't know if you guys know, but... Um, I have what's called a, a soda stream at home um, and uh, what it is it's basically a, a home um, soft drink making kit basically so I put in water I carbonate and then I put in the syrup that, that's all what I do <laughs> but uh, I like it so um, make myself my my drink like I do every day and I don't know what happened I don't think I put on the lid very tight but it basically went all over the place <laughs> all over myself all over the counter and I'm like great just great I didn't shake it or anything like that I, I guess it's just pressure build up or whatnot so I'm like oh great so Clean that all up. Go. I, I wait about, I think, a half an hour. Um, I mean, a, a lot of the gas has already escaped, so. Uh, I'm going to board them. So all the gas escapes, you know. And then uh, I go sit down after a half hour. And I don't know what happened. I might have untwisted the cap or something but it exploded a second time all over me <sighs> so I had to <laughs> clean up myself again and the chair that I was on clean that up luckily I wasn't on my laptop uh, add it to my fleet so yeah, but that that's not the worst part. That, that that's not the worst part. Um that, that that's all minor. Oh, I guess it's uh broken there. Um so my wife goes to bed and normally on a Saturday night after she goes down to bed, I start my recording. Uh I do this this way, you know. I don't disturb anybody and they don't disturb me kind of thing like when I'm recording so it works out pretty well but anyway she goes to bed um, so I go downstairs and I'm like I want to record Caribbean you guys like it I enjoy playing it and whatnot so that's what I'm going to play Start it up, and it crashes. I'm like, what? Start it up again, it crashes again. So, then I start getting scared. <laughs> uh, I start up uh, Viking Conquest, it crashes. I start up Fallout 4, it works. Uh, same with... Um, Dungeon Defenders 2. It also works. Restart my computer. Same thing. Uh, this game is not working. So, as you can see, I have actually fixed the problem after three hours of troubleshooting. Yay! <laughs> just, just to complete the, just to complete the day. Oh, so many like little mini heart attacks. I'm like, oh no, what's going on? Is my 
my my computer busted. Um, what's going on? <laughs> uh, so I'll basically. Um, I didn't. <sighs> All right. Well, first let me explain the problem. Um, so basically, as soon as I started up this game, it crashed. Now. I thought the problem was DirectX, because this game runs on DirectX 9. All the other games I tested were running DirectX 11 or 12. So I tried. I even tried running this game in DirectX 7. Oh, not this one. Viking Conquest, you can, but not this one. And that also did not work. Um, and that's why I thought it might have been a DirectX problem. Uh, Oh, wow. So, I, uh, yeah, so I start, I try to reinstall DirectX 12. Now, that, that that's the biggest problem right there is you can't. <laughs> I looked everywhere for a link to download, like, DirectX 12, because I'm running Windows 10. Uh, it's actually, it's already on the uh, the PC, so I uh, it already comes with Windows. <sighs> so <laughs> so I, I'm looking up forms, see, and of course, everything people are suggesting don't work at all, or or they're not related to my problem. Um, oh, don't wound my guys. There we go. Yeah, they're not related to my prom, or they're all incomplete, and all that nonsense, so. And of course, I'm trying to play a game that's in DirectX 9, and nobody's really playing that those type of games anymore, except for me. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so I spent about three hours. Uh, trying a whole bunch of stuff, re-downloading um, DirectX 9 onto my PC, uh, going over DirectX logs, nothing really saying what's going on. Um, die! Yeah, and it, uh, nothing's like nothing's obvious like coming out that's saying, "Hey, this is the problem." So, um, sorry if I'm getting off a bit a little off tracker off a bit here. It's hard putting my thoughts into words. <laughs> it's also hard coming up with thoughts. Um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, so. I look around, I'm finding nothing. I'm trying everything. I if I even uh installed um uh there's a June uh version of Direct June twenty ten version of DirectX. I installed that. Nothing. So leave. <laughs> so yeah so and and I mean you guys love this game I love this game and I and I'm worried that I'm gonna have to start up this series if you know if I can't fix this which would actually happen because I, I would have no other no other way so um yeah, uh, oh, another thing I tried, I tried doing system restore. Biggest problem is, is there were no restore points. <laughs> I guess I never set one up. Um, so, set one up. <laughs> I still haven't set one up, actually. I, as soon as I started this game, I'm like, yay! Uh, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, so the what the problem actually was, it was my driver. 
Now, I don't know what happened to my driver to actually cause this problem. Um, and the other reason why I thought it was DirectX uh, is I tried playing a very old game that required uh, direct play and I received a couple of error messages when that was coming on um, but everything worked afterwards like like I couldn't play the game anyways the old game which was Lords of Magic I was gonna play that for the live stream um, because it was one of my most favorite games ever <laughs> um, so I, I think that's what screwed everything up. I don't know. But I decided just to completely reinstall my uh, graphics drivers. And then that fixed everything. So, and of course, after I do my test to make sure it's working, I restart my computer, do another test, and it's still working. And then I prayed to every god that there was for thanks and all that. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. But yeah. Um, oh man. Uh, that that was scary. I killed him. That, that was scary. Because uh, another thing that I was worried about was that... Um, my computer was going kaput. Oh, apparently I already had stuff. And I, I don't have money to fix my PC. <laughs> but, uh, the only thing I'm not happy about is that I lost... A lot of potential recording time. So, three hours worth. But I am happy because I fixed it. Doo -doo. Uh. Let's see, is there any dragons? No. So yeah, I am happy. Yeah, and, and it's and I didn't think it was my uh, drivers because I was able to play uh, the other games like. The games that had more. Ooh. Um, like they required a higher version of DirectX. That's why I didn't suspect it was my driver. If if one of those games did fail, I would have actually went right to the driver. But uh, I tried, you know, all the diagnostic tools and all that. Um, uh, the NVIDIA control center never mentioned any problems and uh, none of the checks did either but yeah so it was a, a clean there's uh, when you're installing um, uh, the driver at least for NVIDIA there's a little check mark that says clean install when you go into uh, custom install which basically it kind of it resets all your settings I did that anyway so but it works it works that means I can continue playing this game did I get him to no I did not So that 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 was my day.
least it ends on a happy note. <laughs> well, actually, yeah. Yeah. I mean, day's not over technically yet, but no, no, no. Happy note. I still think the the direct play caused caused my problems. Direct play, um, I think was it's like um, I guess I don't know a hundred percent what it actually was. Uh, I'm pretty sure it was an API. Uh, for DirectX, kind of like with, uh, with three games and all that. Um, I mean, the game that I tried playing, I think it was developed in the early 2000s, maybe in the 90s, so. So. That's probably... I, I still think that's what, what happened. I am not, though, going to test it again to confirm. <laughs> Come here, you! A spread on this. I have no idea. Good. Oh, we level up. Every command. That's not a bad one. So let me just double check here. What's available? Okay. And all traits. Oh wait, what level am I? 16. Four. Four, I need that at least. I like this one because you're always fixing your boat. <laughs> There's another good one too. See that? Which one's this? Oh, that one's a good one. All these ones are good. Let's see if I okay. Where is oh it's navigation. Anyways, I'm gonna increase my intelligence. I'll increase my seafaring. Traits available. I'm thinking skipper. Yeah, we'll get skipper because it's we're gonna go even faster. And Let's 
too bad. I don't even have enough for that anyways. Oh, well, I'll save these. Sweet! Alright! Well, anyways, guys. <laughs> that's going to be it for uh, this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys have a great week. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye! <laughs>